Hello there and welcome to our Tuesday Roundup. The build-up to Saturday's racing at Caulfield continues, particularly to the Group 1 Blue Diamond Stakes, and the barrier draw happened at Caulfield this morning. This is how it turned out. Cracker Roadie, the uh, unlucky scratching from Mornington last week, drew barrier 9. Dissident there for the Moody Stable, out in 15. Thermal Current, also for Peter Moody. A lot of people looking forward to this horse stepping out once again. It's there in barrier 6. Guelph for the Dali team in Barrier 13, Metastasio in Barrier 12. Miracles of Life, well, Barrier 1, it's usually a positive. Will it be for the horse coming from Adelaide? Montsegur also there for Snowden in Barrier 8. Mark Kavanagh quickly scratched Casquettes after drawing 16. Kona Breeze also for Peter Moody in 10 and Quest for Peace for the Moody Stable in Barrier 7. So that's the barrier draw for the Blue Diamond. Stephen Theodore and Kieran McAvoy were on hand to give us their thoughts. Look, it's probably ideal for us. Um, we're not a go-forward horse. We'll be able to slot somewhere in the midfield and be able to stay one off the fence and out of trouble. Um, the horse has pulled up super from his gallop yesterday, so pretty happy days looking forward to Saturday's race. Guelph was always sort of my, my favourite pick. Um, I just... Um, just sort of wanted to see how they went this morning and, and, um, and on their work. There's, there's not a lot between them on their work. They're both nice fillies. They do everything right at home and um, I think um, it's going to be a great race on a great clash with these two rides on Saturday. Um, you know, Guelph's probably the, the filly that um, um, she's going to improve the most and, and might end up the better filly, but um, not a heap between them. The Blue Diamond, one of three Group 1 races happening at Caulfield on Saturday. The latest in Black Caviar news, and they've decided not to go forward to the new market handicap. Peter Moody's decided to save the mare for the William Reid coming up in March. Yeah, we'll give her the five weeks between runs. She pulled up well uh, physically, but she knew she'd had a run on Saturday. You don't run that time in those conditions and not feel it. So we've opted for the softer option, give her the five weeks uh, leading to the William Reid, which realistically is a more sensible option at the weight for age rather than uh, having to give massive weight to a lot of good horses in the new market. The Group 1 Oakley plate at Caulfield on Saturday will be a big moment for trainer Desley Forster. She's bringing Adebisi to the race from Brisbane. Adebisi's done all, we've done all I can with him. He's happy and well and uh, just take it all as it comes. As I said, like, he's probably... Probably not up there in the high markets like a few other said, like Altensia and Baraki, they're going to be pretty hard to beat and they've got, they got outstanding form and they're outstanding horses. Um, so like, this will be, it'll be a good test for him and no weight and hopefully come Wednesday he can draw a nice alley and he'll be competitive. And when Adebisi won at Caulfield a fortnight ago, that was a big enough moment for Desley. Hopefully Adebisi can follow up for her on Saturday. That's the roundup for today. Till next time, enjoy your racing.